In this tech session episode, Don gets really pissed off. Get the f out of here! You can't put this on YouTube now! Yeah. Jeff hears a funny noise. Huh? Well, we got the curve. It's what the hell was that? We got and Butch finds himself in the way again. You know you've got a genuine Volkswagen <laughs> photo shot there if I'm in the way. <laughs> Like you're painting some lug nuts. Yeah. That's not even a Volkswagen. Does that count today for tech session? Yeah. It that's, does? That's my old car. That's the one I sold to Derek. He sold it now. It's not yeah. yours any longer. Okay. Yeah, he put different headlights on. And, uh -huh. and new lug nuts, apparently. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah well, they're the actually, those are the plastic ones that go through the a plastic hubcap. Oh, it's the cover. And he okay, painted them, and he's going to stick them over the uh, okay. lugs. Those are the wheels that he got and painted. Those it, actually it, look good on there. It, yeah, they do. Yeah, look they look good, good on there. Yeah. Actually, it brings out the look of the car because I always yep. thought they were kind of a little. I think it looks. And he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna lower the car too. Well, that'd be cool. Well, all right. What you got going on over there today? So your hood is well, open. Well, I'm actually hoping you could give me a hand. Uh oh, <laughs> calling on the duck man again. Electrical. Electrical. Yeah, yeah. My turn signals. Uh huh. The left hand turn signal switch. Uh huh. Blows a fuse. Oh, like the last right time. Right turn signals work. Emergency flash switch blows a fuse. That's what happened last time. Yeah, but then it was working for it was working fine, and then uh, well, we had the switch apart last time when it was fine, so that's where we got to look. Yeah, it's got got to be something in there. It's grounding out. Uh, something's not it's sitting properly. Uh, the flash switch is brand new. Uh -huh. It was working fine. So I'm thinking I got a bad ground somewhere, maybe. Or... Well, yeah, probably a ground where there's not supposed to be one. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. When you talk I about blowing I just fuses, don't know how to read that stuff out. Glenn. Okay, well, that's what I'm here for. I'll be glad to help you out. Let's go have a look at that in a minute. Appreciate it. First, buddy. we'll go say hello to everybody and see what else is going on here. You the man. There it is, patting on my fat belly. <laughs> you the man. <laughs> that's not my fat belly. It is fat though. But... <laughs> Bragger. <laughs> What's going on over there? Hey, uh, they're putting uh, getting a new top for a new canvas. For a I think I found one here. I guess they're painting something. Oh, Bill, he's working on his exhaust for rust. Oh, okay. He's cleaning all, clean he's up. He's cleaning up Rusty's muff. Cleaning the heater boxes up and painting them. And <laughs> we got the engine in yesterday. 
Oh, good. Good. I good. over gave my hand with that. Oh, he was sending me some pictures of it. Did you see that post for his lip? The what? Well, the, on the front, the little front shaft for the trans or for the transmission, uh -huh. there's a metal block that you know, that sandwiches that little shaft. And if it, that little block is solid steel and it weighs about a pound, I mean, anyway, he's putting it up there and it dropped. He dropped it and it hit him right in the lip. Oh no! Said, yeah, oh yeah. no! <laughs> So Bill's got a cleft palate now, huh? Yeah. <laughs> go, and ask, go and ask him. <laughs> I was running my family. I really shouldn't joke about oh, that. Yeah. Yeah, don't, yeah, that's not, that's not a few generations it's upstream. Funny, Somehow Bill, I managed to miss it. it. To Bill. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what Don is messing up over here. Well, you know, don't over torque it, but you know, well, tighten it up. And you know, the track is a quarter inch thick. Oh, what you got here, Don? Oh, yeah. I'm putting it. What, what kind of, what car Get out of here! <laughs> Get the f out of here! You can't put this on YouTube now! F you! <laughs> put that on YouTube! <laughs> <laughs> what you doing, Don? I am putting a seal, brand new seal, on my Vanagon top. Putting a new tin in it, too. Oh. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna have it crushed? Yes. All right. Now, does it go this way or the other way? I would think this goes up. Come here, Glenn. All right, look at the edge of this. Does it go this way or does this go on that side? Does this go to the outside yeah, or to the inside? Yeah. So that's the ceiling surface. That's like my, my 91. So it goes to the inside. That's right. That's the outside. That's the inside. You got it right. I would say it's right. You don't want that showing on the outside. I knew. That one might be wrong, but the ceiling surface is on the inside. I knew. I was just checking to see if you knew. Do you want it all the way to the edge, though? I don't know. I think there's another piece that goes. Actually, I think we got to put it like right. Start it right about here because there's one that comes. Well, get the other piece and put it on there. Make sure. Well, you can see the line where it was, Don. Let me go get the other piece. You can see the line right there, and you're right even with it. This isn't the other piece. Look at you're yeah, right even. The line. Yeah. yeah, you're right even with it. So where's the other piece? And then get your where's little. Where's the other piece? There. That's what she said. <laughs> the, what? <laughs> She had two. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> or he had two and she wanted a bolt. I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know how to make sense out of that. Come <laughs> back shortly, Don. I used to install it. I'll come back too soon. What? Mm -hmm. We'll, we'll rub them out. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Left. <laughs> watching Don here because he got no idea what he's doing. Yeah, this makes sense. <laughs> yeah, this makes sense. Start that on there, Don. Don always gets in trouble. Remember, he's the one that blew up the gas tank in his face a couple times. Yeah, that's right. It's always exciting at Tech Session. <laughs> you are going to have to do a little bit of editing on that. That's real, though, huh? Oh, it's going to be a fun one, though. Yeah. You're just going to go, bleep, bleep, bleep. We're gonna know you as uh, let's see, sailor. FMD. FMD. Yeah, foul mouth done. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm the MFDM, so you're the FMD. It's pizza time. That's it. Pizza power. Here's what happens when you touch it before you're not supposed to cut your fingers off. Oh no! I thought you just flipped me off. Yeah. Why that? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> there it is. Let's see if I got plates. Hey, Wild Bill asked, how many people does it take to put a seal onto a lid of a vanigan? Well, first of all, you got to catch the seal. That's very true. Oh, oh, oh. Or if it's U.S. Navy SEALs, you ain't gonna catch them. You know what Don does with a SEAL, right? Yeah. <laughs> Club them? There'll be oh, some clever that. editing. You'll have to watch the video. I hear you talking about me. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about you. Not only is he talking about you, he's videoing you again. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, Don. Say the F-bomb again. <laughs> we don't care. <laughs> It will look like that one right over there, Glenn. When it's done. Yeah. 
Except he'll have a crush shortly thereafter. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you got some left over. That's it. You're gonna have to send it back. It's too long. You're fired. That's what she said. Hey. What? Keep the noise down. <laughs> You're gonna offend some. I'm offended. <laughs> I'm offending you. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Apologies. <laughs> apologies. Oh, what's up? Oh, 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 you. <laughs> See, you're too slow, Don. That's what she said. Here. No, you can't. You're doing great. <laughs> yeah, I only got one thumb. I got another one I can hit on you. You're gonna hit on him? Oh my God. Oh no. <laughs> this is not the kind of video we want to show. <laughs> yeah, not, not, not for uh, polite audience. Here. Yeah. Rated X. <laughs> rated X for her pleasure. Yeah. Oh, I saw one X-rated movie in the theater. Flesh Gordon. Oh, I know that yeah. one. I've never seen it, but I know hilarious. about the bits from it. My dad told me about his it. Rocket, his rocket ship looked like a... A, a dick. A dick, a dick oh, with sparks shooting out the back. Yes, sir. Right out the nuts. You got that thing looks good. Yeah. And another one uh, that was got a, a, a real uh, rating that, that was nasty was Barbarella. I heard something today. That's not porn, though. I know it's not porn. It's not but porn. In fact, there's porn. not even really any nudity in it. Yes, there was. Not really. Mm. Not really. I mean, there kind of was, but it was like suggested nudity. Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe I'm thinking of behind the green door. Never mind. <laughs> or the holy mountain or something. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, because that's, that's aluminum in there. Lots and lots of what? If I had my bus here, you would have razor snips. This is what happens when we set the wolves loose in here. <laughs> oh crap, there's still a couple pieces left. I'm going to eat the one with the peppers. <laughs> Good stuff. Here goes the last right, piece. There it is. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice for you, Don. For you. Right. Mm-hmm. Thank you. I want to get that last bite in there. Go ahead. And it's gone. <laughs> we really need some more interesting stuff here. Yeah, he'll give you the history. Looks good, there, Bill. Hey, check my lip. Oh my. That is a result of a one pound chunk of steel that I was bolting my transaxle up to the bus last night. Put it, one screw in, uh -huh. thought it was in there, uh -huh. reached down to get the other screw and it fell one foot into my face. Uh, that looks worse than what, uh, what hurt, I was just getting told. It didn't hurt, it didn't hurt the steel bar at all. <laughs> <laughs> How's your teeth, Are you okay? Um, uh, oh shit, I just pulled a scab loose. God damn it, why'd you make me do that? <laughs> But anyway, Just, I mean, that's probably your no, lip will heal, but your teeth won't. <laughs> I laid on the ground for 30 seconds with my face and my hands like this, and Jeff's going, you okay, you okay? And I said, nothing. He said, what's the matter, what's the matter? Can you breathe? And I said, dude. Just let me recuperate. Uh, Give me about 30 more seconds. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. It's good thing you have the mustache. It kind of hides it. <laughs> well, yeah. It's... <laughs> Looks like you just got some dirt on your lip. <laughs> what? Yeah. It's still a little swollen, though. Probably. probably it's a little nice. puffy, yeah. Oh, yeah, my lip. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But, but, uh, thankfully, you didn't lose any teeth. I mean, that could have hmm. been bad. Actually, it's not pain. It's painless right now. It's like, it didn't really happen. But, yeah. You know, but... Yeah. The well, hairs we'll do. on my mustache in the scab, but when I pull them, then yeah, yeah. What we'll do is we'll take you out for some of them spicy wings again and oh. rub that on your lip. No. <laughs> I gotta have full recovery before that happens. <laughs> what you guys don't know is we actually had some spicy wings last week, was it? Yeah. And uh, what were they? The um, Carolina Reaper. Carolina Reaper pepper wings. And uh, I, I could eat like one at a time. I have to take a break in between them, but while Bill. Just a little dot of sauce, and that messed him up for hours. On my little finger, <laughs> on my tongue, and it was immediately like I'd been stuck my mouth in a, to a 220 volt lot wall socket. Like, <laughs> well, now your lip looks like you've been oh, into a man, 220 volt. Yeah, my lip blew up. But uh, yeah, I got the engine in. Uh, the good. Transaxle, good. Good. It went in with the engine and transaxle uh -huh. at the same time. 
engine's in. I'm doing a little bit of cosmetic uh, work on the exhaust. Stuff engine. nobody will ever see but you. Uh, well, unless they come to a tech session, I got it all. That's out true. <laughs> or I'll flip it upside down or something. Well, as we had discussed, uh, that's the stuff that uh, you paint it up and it looks pretty, but you know, after a few hundred miles, it's all covered in Volkswagen gunk again. <laughs> yeah. Well, like, a, like a, the picture that I posted of my engine, it looks great now. Yeah, it looked great. Great to paint off of getting the engine in, but. Five five weeks now, I probably have a wall over. You know? <laughs> I'll share that up on the screen for people that uh, haven't gotten to see it. Oh yeah, yeah, it turned out really good, and uh, it's it's uh, if it runs as good as it looks. That engine has got about fifteen or twenty miles on it. That's it. All brand new stuff. Oh wow! Counter counterbalance crankshaft, new camshaft, new rods, new pistons, new cylinders. Uh, heads are new. I mean, it's basically. Uh, a, a brand new engine. I didn't realize you went through all but that it, on there. It, it, but it's setting, been setting on my porch because the carburetors burn off of it. Oh, it was that one? Yeah. Okay, okay, that, I remember it that. A, it yeah. wasn't the big fire that I had. It was the one well, after still, that. It was a fire nonetheless. Yeah, when it's, I left it's my still driveway, frightening. turned left, and got down to about a quarter of a mile down the road, and now it looked like the Blue Angels again. <laughs> So anyway, uh, but you oh, survived it. Oh yeah. So did Rusty. Well, I might have to actually break this engine in because it hasn't been broken in yet. I mean, I, I set the cam, you know, the the 20, 2500 RPM mm -hmm. for twenty mm -hmm. minutes, or whatever, and uh, didn't blow oil on my foot like I did one time. Oh uh, yeah, uh, I'll put that on the screen for you that didn't see thank it either. You. Right? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That was a good video, though. I mean, it was it was a nice scanning going back and forth. There was yeah, a little action in there. And, you haven't used that very much. Uh, well, I used it only the one time we needed it, but uh, now we talked about it. I'll put it back up on the yeah, screen. So it was it was amusing. And of course, it didn't happen to you once that day. Yeah. <laughs> it flew out on you twice, and I got both times on video. I saw the little shimmer in the camera, yeah. and I'm looking at the camera, not you. Yeah. So I'm seeing a shimmer, and I don't know what it is. It took me a second, and you didn't quite react, and that's when I went, ah! <laughs> so I tried to be loud enough that you could hear me over the engine roaring. <laughs> don't worry. It, it pleasantly reminded me that I needed and you to had, get my leg out. Yeah, and you had jumped right about that same time. Yeah. So. <laughs> ah! anyway, People got on me about the scream. Um, hopefully, uh, we can get some shots of Rusty back in action again here soon. That'd be great. Probably tomorrow. Um, getting the, I, I, I worked on it till midnight last night, freezing my ass off. Oh yeah, it was a cold one last there. night. We were just talking uh, about that earlier. Got everything hooked up underneath. Now I gotta do the above stuff. You know, I hooked up the, the starter wires, I hooked up uh, this, that, and the other, you know, disconnected the, uh, or connected the fuel lines. And uh, I still gotta put the exhaust system on, but and then the tin, and then all the wires. Awesome. We are about there. Yes, sir. Lot, Just about there. A lot, uh, lot better. If I get an exhaust leak on that thing, I think I will burn it. Then, you know, that's that's been my problem. Type four engine's a good engine, but the heads are just like unless you pay a fortune for it. You know those um, men, whatever his name is, there in George's heads, and those yeah. things are super expensive. So, oh, uh, they're good. Uh, Raby. Yeah, well, actually, Raby buys them from Glenn Hoffman. That's who. Oh, does he? Okay. Yeah, he buys them from him. Really? Okay. And uh, they're Hoffman heads. Hoffman and, heads. Yeah, about the best. The, the Hoff. But uh, <laughs> yeah, they're pretty pricey. They're about eight or nine hundred dollars a piece. So, uh, oh my. Yeah. Okay. Or maybe not. Well, if you want a good that. engine, though, but still. Yeah. But um, anyway, that's what I'm doing. Well, fantastic. Enjoying this nice, beautiful weather out here today. It is a nice day. It was cold when I got out there this morning. I was yeah. starting up Ruby, and, you know, it hasn't yeah. been started in a few weeks, and she's Did got no chokes. Wash so Ruby? No. Wash? Ruby? Nope. No, no. She's actually filthy right now. It looks shiny from a distance. Oh, that's from when I cleaned it up for the show. It's still got some oh. wax on it. <laughs> yeah, that was in October, dude. <laughs> yeah, I know. I haven't washed since, but, you know, I have no garage tent anymore, so it's like I wash it. It's just going to be dirty again the next morning. Yeah. So it doesn't make much sense. I got to replace those garage tents, which is something in my very, very near future, because that's holding up my entire 
YouTube channel from Progress yeah. is the inability to store anything, therefore everything's in the house so I can't friggin' move and find anything. It's just terrible. You need to do a hoarder's uh, video. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put that on the screen, too, yeah. for those of you that haven't seen Actually, my hoarder's no primo. <laughs> nah, they, they probably have ideas, but it would be foolish of them to assume that you were going to let Yeah, they're going to get a bullet in their ass. Well, that, and they'll be well documented uh, doing it. Uh, Not to mention there's trip wires and things around oh, yeah, too so and, uh, hey, oh yeah we, we get him duck. don't forget about the attack duck well no i take him away because he's stupid <laughs> he'll get hurt <laughs> well, they, they might trip over him and bust their head open but, anyway. but uh yeah i'm gonna try to try to do some more wild bill vw adventures i, I on youtube right for our yeah. YouTube fans to see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody wants to see you on YouTube. Yeah, you got to get on YouTube. I'm, I'm harassing you now. Oh, I know, I know. I've been telling you a couple yeah. years. I've been telling Carlos, too. Well, I've been posting <laughs> Wild Bill VW Adventures stories on, you know, Facebook and a different... Uh, Just repost them on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. that's what's going to make you the money, too. Uh, yeah, think about that. Well, I, I need all the money I can get after this adventure. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I took a lot of battle wounds on this one, uh, and... Uh, yeah. yeah. How about your face? Oh, my. I uh, know. My face always looks like that. <laughs> oh, you're talking about my lip. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had my lip busted open like that since, oh, probably high school when I used to fight. Fighting? Yeah, fighting. Yeah, fighting yeah. But uh, Glenn Coster, he put down there, when are you going to learn that no means no? <laughs> <laughs> and I said never. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. That was that was a misadventure right there, but uh, and like I said, that big steel bar did not get damaged at all. Yeah, it, it worked. Actually, you should have said you should see the steel bar now after I got done with it. Well, <laughs> lay down on your back and get underneath the bus. And, <laughs> yeah. But anyway, let me uh, get back to watching awesome. the paint dry and uh, there you go. fun. Thank you for coming out here today and enjoying our <laughs> uh, adventures with Volkswagens. We got a lot of. A little different activities going on. Not yep. a little busy. Pizza's on the way, by the way. I was just going to go harass Don because yeah. that's my first question ordered, in a video every day. I ordered day. it from um, another company besides where we usually get it. Oh, really? Yeah. Notice you don't have to blurb that out. No. I usually don't anyway. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> All right, it's Papa John's, goddammit. Oh, the dough ball pizza. Yeah, but... Actually, I prefer Hungry Howie's. Well, you know. <laughs> uh, you should have been here when I ordered it. Anyway. Oh, well. <laughs> okay. All right, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. Peace out. And we got a wiper motor over here, wiper arms. And I've got the grommet, but I don't have any nuts or anything for it. Okay, do you have some on your car already that we can take off? I got nothing. I got oh, there's all. no wiper at all. <laughs> okay. Well, that's going to be a little tough to install it with all the parts. I like that. I've never seen those on there before. I really like that. <laughs> Um, yeah, you're gonna have a little problem without all the parts. Uh, if Don's got a set of nuts here, and I think they're the same on a standard Beetle, you could probably, probably just, yeah. just put it on, and then I think we'll be okay. Yeah. But that's where we'll start. But underneath the hood, is it easy to get to? Yeah. Okay, just gotta pull the air box out, huh? Yeah. Okay, that's not too awfully bad. That's pretty much on a standard Beetle, too. Yeah, and then we can look at his or whatever. I don't know how to hook it up on this, all this over here, but... Oh, uh, into the wiring, you mean? Yeah. Is the switch still in place? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to work without a switch. <laughs> well, I've got some... Um... Oh, custom dash. Okay. okay. Look at that. All custom. So none of this, all this stuff, the oil, the green light, red light, all... Okay. I hardwired this into here. Uh-huh. Emergency off. Yeah, I don't see a wiper switch in here though, unless... We can hardwire it into this guy. It's usually a two-speed wiper switch, but I think you can still use a single switch if you want to. You just have one speed. That's how it works, is there's a different set of uh, coils inside the motor that changes the timing of the motor so it slows it down. Let's look at and see where... Oh, yeah. Should be in the middle of the dashboard. That's what's nice about it. If you do it, you don't like it. Oh well. Oh, okay. I think it's on the center to the upper right hand. Yeah, yeah. I did it on my uh, okay. on my bus on those wheels. I I'm learning. One of them white, 
So you'll need a two-speed switch if you want to run two-speed, otherwise it's one-speed all the time, but typically wipers are so slow anyway that your top speed is all yeah. you want. <laughs> right now I'm, I'm spraying rain -X on it and sticking my arm out the, like this morning with the, uh, I had uh, <clears throat> cold outside mm -hmm. fogging it up and condensation on the inside, so I'm rubbing it. <laughs> Standard off, on a Volkswagen. Wax off kind of a thing. Is yeah. your heater working? Heater? Yeah. What heater? That's why I asked. Yeah. Because if you have the heater, it does help quite a bit to defrost the windshield, believe it or not, especially yeah. if it's hooked up right. Uh, some one on a fast bag works great. You just got to get the engine nice and warm first before you drive. <laughs> yeah. So the, the, gas, the gas is... I'd like to know, you know, that, that you can just shake it. Yeah, but I don't know how much is in here, and I don't hear good, you know. So. Are you, what are you concerned about? The gas tank coming out? No, about running out of gas. That's why I got this thing wrote, wrote gas on there. Oh, your fuel gauge not working? No, that's what I'm saying. No, yeah, this is brand new. Uh -huh. I just put this in. Oh, I don't see a wire on it. Okay, that I makes got sense. I've got some, yeah, I got yeah. some wires on it. So. It's usually just one wire, actually. Goes right to the gas gauge. Doop, done. So that'd be nice. You could do it the old way that the early Volkswagens did. They yeah. came with a wooden dowel. A wooden dowel? A wooden dowel. You open the gas cap and you dip it in and pull it out and it tells you how much is in there. <laughs> that was your gas gauge. I kid you not. Really? Yep, that's what the earliest Beatles came with. I wonder if I could get by the <laughs> I'm totally into that. You probably could. I mean, it's it's almost a straight shot. I like, I like simple. If not, coat hanger or something. I mean, you can get in there. Uh, if it's just a wire... So it goes from from the this. right from here up to the the vibrator on the gas gauge. Where is that at? It might even be that one. Okay. I'll have to double check and check the um the uh, schematic. This looks like Hold on. that looks like it's the power that goes to. Huh. Am I looking at the right part of the gauge? Yes, I am. That's the fuel gauge in the top. There is it. What are you talking about? Yeah. My wife was nice and laminated yeah, well, it. Well, that's really sweet of her. <laughs> you know. Those are nice to keep in the car with you. Yeah. Yeah. So, I don't the know. The gas gauge is, uh, it's in there in the middle. Right here. So, but we don't know. Yep. I see, I look at that and all I see is red and blue. <laughs> these brown ones. I have to put these, the camera down and look more closely. These but, brown uh, ones are grounds. Browns are ground, that's correct. Yeah, I know that. Now, the fuel gauge actually is a brown wire that goes to the, uh, the sender. It's usually brown with a black stripe. But that right. still indicates that it is a, a ground because it's a brown. <clears throat> so the uh, sender actually grounds itself out. Yeah, I think the problem was underneath the wheel. That's a brand new switch. Well, it doesn't mean anything. Let me get the uh, socket and pull it off. Okay. <laughs> yeah, in time. Get a chance. Show me hand What you doing here, Jeff? Oh. See, capless. Mm -hmm. Are you taking out your trying sausage to, there, man? Trying to come out, he was jumping for some reason. I don't know. Must be hungry. <laughs> <laughs> don't get up, Jeff. I won't. Oh, I'm... <laughs> yeah, key's off. It ain't gonna honk. <laughs> That's a damn shame, actually. It's kind of funny when it does. <laughs> That's the way he's taking off. I'm gonna fix the switch. Uh, I thought it was a good brand new switch. I could, well, I guess it could be broke. Yeah, yeah, it's probably in the wiring. It was making China while Mexico. Right there. Because it's Mexican. It Mexican parts. Yeah. The Chinese Mexican hey, Glenn, parts. Yeah. The first time it did that, uh, Todd said. But this collar here might have been too close to the wheel. Yeah, somebody else told me that on YouTube also. So I also. did move it, uh -huh. and it and it fixed it. It did? Okay. Yeah, so I, I moved it again the other day. I mean, that's... How'd you move it? With a washer? No, there's two screws right here. Oh. You just loosen these Allen okay. screws and slide it I didn't forward. realize it was that simple. I thought you had to space the wheel out. It's not, yeah, not something I ever gap, experienced. See that gap right there? Uh-huh, I see it. That's a huge gap. That's a huge gap! I'm wondering, maybe it still is. Maybe it's, it's still too It's huge. Yeah, last time. It's huge. It's still yeah, it's a big gap. It might be part of the. You got the same issue last time. It's like no, the switch is new, but that don't mean. Crazy. That still, don't mean anything. Maybe no. it's still too close. I don't know. It might be. Uh oh. 
Don't break it. Hope you marked it. I did. <laughs> See that little mark? <laughs> oh, that's not the mark you're supposed to put. You know what happens to me when I honk my horn? Uh -huh. on you're my supposed buggy. to mark on, uh, on here instead. Supposed to mark where? Yeah, every, every now and again. Right on the, uh, the threads here, <laughs> on the end. So that yeah. way you got their lines. I guess I won't well, I just lined it up with that. Jeez, keep my hand off the horn. <laughs> if that wheel was too close. But that, that was a good gap, though. I mean, that, that should have been good enough, I would think. You huh? well, we got the curb and stuff. Yeah. What the hell was that? He farted. Shit. Driving. Man, that pizza is making some. Did it burn? Wasn't one of them screws a little stripped or some shit? Yeah, this one's not. Yeah. This is the only one that really tightens up good. Only one, oh. See, Jeff, I think don't so. order more in eBay from China. More and now screws. I was missing one, but I found it. It's in a little bag in there. What but was I it doing I in there? Get, yeah, I couldn't get it to start. Why was it in the glove box? <laughs> <laughs> That's a weird spot for it to have yeah. been, been found. It's been in there for years then, huh? All right. <laughs> What are we looking for? Yep. Looking to see where it grounds out on the column. So when you pull your wiring harness up, there should be a plastic sleeve or something that's on. Where's the sleeve? Uh oh. You can't see it now, of course, because your head's in the way. But <laughs> uh, you want? Usually there's a plastic sleeve up inside of there, but you know, maybe yours is different for your year, but I don't see it, which is really odd. Uh oh. What? Bob alert and a butch alert. Here, let's do it like we usually do. There we go. Now it's a typical YouTube yeah. video for tech session right here. You know you've got a genuine Volkswagen <laughs> photo shot there if I'm in, in the way of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> He's not yeah, plugged there. there. Every tech plugged session in, in the wrong spot when he's taking it. Mm -hmm. He just stepped right in front of the camera. <laughs> Yeah, what we're looking at here, if we pull on the hazards, it's no longer blowing a fuse now that we have the switches out. I'm noticing that there's a little scratch mark in here up on the circlip. So apparently something is rubbing, or at least that's what we're thinking. And you notice how this is manufactured, it looks like some of these little guys might be rubbing in there where they should be and causing a little grounding situation, which is blowing fuses. I'm thinking it's one yeah. of these two yeah, because that's those... probably what it is. Yeah. I'm thinking so. I'm we thinking, need to see these here, these two, they're outside of that. They're gonna be right. Yeah, as long as they're not rubbing. So I'm thinking it it's those one of those two. But even these, it wouldn't hurt to flatten them. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna push so I'm press gonna, them down. Yeah, I could probably do it by hand. Maybe. No, I can't, they're pretty <laughs> stiff. Yeah, I would start there and see what you got. But the little scratch marks in here that are on there tells me that something was definitely right, rubbing man. on it. Yeah, okay, that's where I would start. That might just solve your problem. I, got a, uh, I mean, last week just playing with it was enough to make it stop, pair, but apparently uh, last month, I should say, last month when you made the adjustments in here, it worked for a little while. Is this another loose wire? No, that's attached, okay. Yep, that's where I would start, Jeff. I gotta, here, hop out for just for a sec, Glenn. Hop, I like gotta, a rabbit? Yeah. <laughs> or, or squeeze out. I've got a straight <laughs> slot screwdriver, one if I can put it in that groove, yeah, I'd be able to push that bit. down. Yep, all right, let me step out of here for you. Turn that key back off. <laughs> Guess who found it? What? The Miftum, that's right, A MFDM. Right. <laughs> see, those, see those two uh, plugs, those yes. no wires mm, plugs. Yes. that were sticking up? See that little scratch mark on the circlip there? It, yeah, it was welding it. Yep. Like I saw, it was probably yeah, touching it. Yeah. It was arc welding this. No, whenever I hit the switch, it was rubbing, it was hitting right there. I get, some, I get some sandpaper and knock that down. No, it just push these. Yeah, there's been little things in there. It might just, just be enough to do it. What'd you do, Bert? I wire? would start there oh, anyway. Oh, Glenn, I found out why that one screw don't go in. Look, we're all screwed. Except, uh, yeah. No. The little hole missing? What? No, there's a hole full of broken off screw. <laughs> <laughs> Don't no way I'm getting that sucker out of there. No, you'll have to that that drill it and tap it. That's your only way. Shoot, yeah. you got something that Use small? Angle grinder well, right. yeah. That's a, <laughs> <laughs> that's a tiny, that's a tiny that's little what she right said. there. Threaded for her pleasure. Yeah. <laughs> Man, almost. God, it's here. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. He's the guy. <laughs> 
He's got to, owns that Baja right over there. Oh, okay. He's got to throw a socket in his head. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall down, dog. <laughs> we know what happens when men fall at your age. <laughs> Flip it over and put it up. So that side's coming over this way, yep, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right, you got under control. Here those, it comes. Those All right, let's go. And flip it over. over. Ramp it over. Try not to pull the seal off. Yeah, okay, you got that? Yep. Okay, dog, I, I got this. Top. Don't put it on backwards. Right, I got this. Okay. All right, we're going to yeah. need some tall people. Yeah, now, Jeff, you go to the front. I got this. You got the wrong you end go going in Bill's first. Side. Go to Bill's side. Oh, no. You're putting in the wrong end first. Are we? We need somebody inside. Jeff, get over there and help Bill. I need someone else yeah, on the corner here. Said, Bob, Glenn, somebody. Glenn's taller. Yeah, but I'm recording. I'm trying to get everybody Bill, screwing this up. Glenn, Glenn's filming. Leave Grab your low. corners. Yeah, oh, geez, everybody's corner. yelling at me. I want to help, but there, like I can. <laughs> Don's mad. Oh, what's that canvas? Oh, yeah, yeah. There you go. Go easy. Sure? I got this. All right. Settle down, Don. We're back, buddy. Didn't act like this is the first time he'd done this, Don. I could have done this alone. Down, center right there. All right. All He's right. done. Shut the tape. So, Don, what'd you think of that? Right now. Good. How'd it go? It went great. I need. How'd it go, Don? I think it went fantastic. <laughs> what do you think? How'd it go? How'd it go, Glenn? What do you think? You'll see it on video. I will? Yeah. Should've got that one from on the steps over here. Yeah, actually that would've been better. Yeah, that would've been better. Shooting down from above. Oh, I think I split my lip again. Again? Oh, it on did. Yeah, it's on backwards. What we'll do is we'll put a new rubber seal on your lip. <laughs> and then the kid will pull it off. <laughs> hey, what? <laughs> Butch, you're worse than I am. <laughs> the lid's on upside down. The Westphalia is over. Go yeah, yeah. Needs, that West Valley needs to be on the other side. That's a shame we couldn't peel it off and flip it over and then stick it on. Oh, make him wonder how it happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This would be perfect for supporting it. Are you having fun? Are you having fun is the big question. I'm having a lot of fun. Yeah? How much fun are you having? A lot. I can't wait to go camping in this thing. Christmas! Oh. What happened, Bob? Did the wind know, blow? I, you know, uh, I'm not, I just Bob, maybe my, my tolerance level is about uh, negative. Did I really f*** you up, Bob? I was just playing with not you. I'm sorry. Much, I didn't mean to get you. Not mad. as much as I'm <laughs> All right, Bob. I'm not gonna mess with you no more today. See, I've 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 pushed a little too hard. Yeah, the only way it's worse if this was a car show money that I counted and recounted and counted. Well, it's and not it that. It still much didn't much come out right. The first year of time in 20 years, it didn't come out right when I huh. got to the bank. What happened there? I don't. If I knew, I could. I would have fixed it. Oh. You don't count the number of bills. Did you have sticky fingers? Were you put in your pocket? No, it's always good that you, you get more money counted for in the deposit. Oh, went up instead. That, yeah. Oh, that's good. That's always good. So you just pocket the difference? No. <laughs> no. Never. Well, that was all for a Volkswagen Tech Session. I had to run it a little bit short because I had to escape. My PO box received a large package that was required for a job that I'm doing this weekend. So I had to run out and get it at the very last minute. They were only open a few more minutes, so uh, yeah, I had to cut it short. Anyways, as always, you guys, click your like and comment, subscribe, click that dingle belly, that way you get updates every time that I upload a new video. And uh, watch for the next tech session. Don't forget, if you want to check out when and where our tech sessions are at, hit up rarerrvw.com, click the link to our Facebook page, and check out our events. We'd love to have you. Open invite to everybody. Just come on out. We'll see you next time.